Hi, I'm Lou Salcida from TAC-1. We're here today with LA Police Gear to show you the presentation of the pistol. This particular methodology that we use is a training tool. Uh, what we're going to do is break it down step by step for you. Common question is, why do we even have a methodology for taking the pistol out of the holster and replacing it? Well, all you have to do is uh, look online and you'll see there's a number of videos out there where people have shot themselves either taking their pistol out of the holster or replacing it back in. What I want to do next is introduce you to Tom Luna, our instructor. He's going to get up here and, and break it down for you point by point. Tom? Thanks, Lou. I'm Tom. This is Shoji, and we're going to demonstrate the five count presentation of the pistol. Today, we're going to be using a Blackhawk Serpa holster and a Blackhawk demonstration gun for this video. Now, to get started, Shoji's going to get into a shooting stance. Now, on count one, the support hand is going to go to the middle of the chest and the primary hand is going to get a firing grip on the pistol. Now when you get this firing grip, you want to make sure that the web of the hand is high up in the tang of the pistol and the trigger finger is along the side of the frame. Now on count one, make sure that you, re you release any kind of retention on the holster. We're going to press on the Serpa release on the holster so that he can come out of that holster. Now on count two, he's going to bring the pistol out of the holster and his wrist is going to be touching his rib cage. This is going to help us in uh, controlling the recoil when the weapon is fired from this position. You'll also notice that the muzzle is slightly elevated and the weapon is canted slightly away from the body so that when he fires from this position, the slide doesn't impact his clothing or his body, which would create a malfunction. The support hand stays on the midsection so that he doesn't cover his hand when he comes out of the holster. Now on count three, He's going to bring both hands together close to the body and extend his arms into a low ready position. He creates a firing grip with both hands on the pistol, making sure that there is 360 degree coverage around the grip of the pistol. His eyes are focused down range and he's ready to fire when he needs to. On count four, he's going to raise the pistol to eye level, coming up on target, setting the finger on the trigger and taking in any slack on the trigger. He is now focused on the front sight and ready to fire and count five is actually pressing the trigger. Now after firing from this position, we want to make sure that there are no additional threats. So Shoji's going to go to a low ready position with his finger alongside the frame and he's going to assess the tactical situation. If there is nothing else to shoot, we're going to return to the holster the same way we came out of the holster. Shoji's going to go to count two and then he's going to go to count one, gently setting the pistol down into the holster. We don't want to rush back into the holster because nobody ever won a gunfight by speed holstering. So make sure you take your time and do it safely. That's the five count presentation of the pistol. Make sure you practice safely to enhance your shooting skills. And remember, like any new piece of equipment, you've got to practice with it to be proficient. Stay tuned to LAPoliceGear.com for additional training videos.